up you guys and welcome back to my channel so today I am so excited because I am going to be reviewing and sharing my first impressions on the dose of colors Desi X Katie collection I was waiting for this to come in the mail for so long and now it is here and I just quickly jumped to do this first impressions for you guys I have not opened the box yet because I wanted to reveal my true first impressions I only got two items from the collection so I got the girls eyeshadow palette and I got one lipstick so I will be swatching all of these shadows for you guys and trying on the lipstick and swatching that as well but without further ado let's just jump into this video for starters I love the packaging I love that the packaging is nude I honestly did not expect this I know that their PR boxes had a nice matte nude packaging but obviously they go like the extra mile for PR packages I didn't expect this box to be nude I just expected it to be in a brown box but no they surprised me with that and I think that was really cute. So I'm so excited. Okay, so this is the first time I'm opening this box. Oh ah, my god, look at them. They look so beautiful. They are so freaking stunning. Oh my god. This is them in hot fire, I think. Oh my god. Stunning. And then in the box it says Desi X Katie. Ah. So it comes with an eyeshadow guide. I know that two of the shadows are supposed to be used wet. The other two don't need it, but they do recommend that you use your finger to apply it. So I watched all the videos on that. I love everything. Everything is like nude, 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 nude. They even have a little sticker that says Desi X Katie. Okay, so let's start off with the eyeshadow palette. It comes in this beautiful rose gold type of packaging. And then when we open it up, I know that this packaging is going to be gorgeous because I've seen so many pictures everywhere. Ah, so pretty. Oh my goodness. Okay, so when we open it up, it has a beautiful little mirror. It is small, but it's big enough. I'll tell you that. It's big enough to see what you want to do. It's a good quality mirror. It's not like a cheap mirror, you can tell. Oh my god, these shadows. I can't wait to play with these. Okay. So first, let me go ahead and swatch these. So the first shade is Noli. Second shade is Suze. The third color is Harpoon. I'm gonna wet my finger. And the last one is Turbo Sun. So here are all four colors swatched for you. I think that it is super, super cute that they named this palette after their dogs. I don't think a lot of people know that. People that follow them obviously know that their dogs are everything to them. I love my pets, so this is definitely something that is super cute and I think that I would do as well. Now, I obviously already did my face makeup and I put a crease color in my crease <laughs> so I wanted to try one of the shadows out on my lid I think I'm going to do turbo sawn when it's officially fall I want to play around with harpoon and maybe do like a whole like look on it so I'm gonna take my finger and place turbo sawn on the lid I'm just gonna zoom you guys in here oh my goodness that's so pretty Okay, so I went ahead and blended the eyeshadow with the eyeshadow that I already had in my crease. So this is how it turned out. Now I'm going to take Noli and I'm going to put it in my inner corners. Oh my god. There is a little bit of fallout, I'm not gonna lie, but it's nothing like too crazy. Okay guys, so I went ahead and put on some lashes. I wanted to stay true to the Desi and Katie way and I know that one of Desi's favorite lashes is House of Lashes and these are the iconic lights. My thoughts on the girls palette is that the colors are stunning. I know that Noli and Suze are very common colors, you know, a bronze color and a champagne color. They're colors that you see very often, there's nothing special about them, but Harpoon and Turbo Sun are something that is very different, something that I haven't really seen before, and the reflex on them 
is beautiful. They have such a beautiful reflex when they catch the light and I think that they did a great, great job. So the collection is sold out at the moment, but I do know that they will be relaunching in September. So if you haven't gotten your hands on any of these items and you weren't sure if you wanted to get any, I definitely recommend to get the eyeshadow palette because it is so beautiful. Moving on to the lips. I did only get one lipstick and the shade that I got was more creamer, please. And this packaging is so cute. I don't know if you can really tell, but it has Desi and Katie's signatures on the tube. Okay, I'm gonna swatch more creamer, please, for you. Okay, and this is more creamer, please, on my lips. It feels so smooth, so buttery and creamy. I really, really like the texture. I've heard great things about Dose of Colors lipsticks. I actually forgot to mention that this is my first time ever trying any Dose of Colors products, so I'm very pleased with it. I think this color is very, very pretty. I picked it because of the name and also because it was a darker shade of the two that were offered. I love coffee, so I was like, yes, honey, more creamer, please. <laughs> also, I noticed that this lipstick smells really, really good. It smells like cupcake. I'm actually kind of disappointed because I wish that I had gotten more colors I have seen so many people wearing hot fire and Savage and they are such beautiful colors And I think that I want to buy more of the colors once they relaunch in September So do I think that you guys should go and purchase some of the Desi X Katie collection? I definitely do I think that this collaboration as a whole was very put together You can tell that they took a lot of time in choosing the colors and the products. It felt very personalized and you could tell that a lot of hard work was put into it. I know that for the eyeshadow palette, they wanted to create something that would be like your go-to glam palette. Like you wouldn't want to reach for anything else. And I think that they did that. The formula for the lipstick is creamy. It's smooth, it's soft, it's velvety. It doesn't feel like it's even there. It feels very nice and comfortable. So was this collab worth it for me? Yes, 100%. I will be leaving all of the price information down below so you can kind of plan out what items you want ahead of time because they are probably going to sell out fast. That is all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below because I put out new videos every single week. Also make sure to hit that notification bell so you can be notified notified every single time I upload. As always, I love you very much and I will see you in the next one. Bye!